Over at 745 and 57 degrees at KNEB on toward 85 or so this afternoon. It's News Extra Time. Here's Kevin Moody. Thank you, Dennis. Good morning, everyone. Our guests today on News Extra are Lola Gonzalez from the YMCA. Don Luce is here as well. And he's from the uh, uh, Nebraska Masons. And uh, we're going to talk about uh, uh, Celebrate Healthy Family Kids Day at the Y. And the Masons are also going to be there, do a child identification program. And that's why Don's here. So we're going to let him go first. He, Like I said, he's with the uh, Nebraska Freemasons. And uh, Don, you guys have been doing this with this uh, Healthy Family Kids Day for a while. Tell us how it works. Well, <clears throat> this is about a, either our sixth or seventh year. <clears throat> Just a point of information. Uh, every year there's over uh, 2 million children that are missing in the United States. Mm -hmm. In 2005, there was over 2,000 missing in Nebraska alone. Now, most of them are found right away, but some of them aren't. And that's the reason for the child identification program. <clears throat> what we do, there's a video interview, there's a fingerprint, there's a uh, tooth print, and then we have a uh, DNA uh, check swab, then we have a still photograph, and we've added a new item, and we have a scent pad. That would be for the uh, dogs. And this scent pad, they, you take some uh, uh, skin particles, and you, and you put it away. Now, everybody's unique in skin particles. Nobody's the same. It's just like a fingerprint. And we feel with that, that might even help with what we've been doing. <coughs> we've had about 15 uh, local business people help with the cost of this. Each one of these kits cost five dollars and it's all done free for these children. I think I've pretty well covered that, Kevin. All right, so uh, the idea is to uh, come up with fingerprints and toothprints and DNA cheek swabs and all that kind of stuff uh, to help identify your child if for some reason they turn up missing and uh, there has to be a search conducted. Uh, this stuff is available to the law enforcement authorities and they can go out and uh, look for your child and help uh, with the dogs, the, the scent swab and all that stuff and help out and look for your kids. So right. so this is a good thing to do. They're, uh, they're going to be out there 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Fleasbaugh Center over at the YMCA West Camp south of the zoo. And like you said, the Masons have been doing this for what, six or seven years right. now? Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, explain real quick because I know you have to leave here this morning, but um, why do you guys? Why did you guys decide this is something you wanted to do? Well, basically, there was there was uh, some children that were missing back in I think it was in Illinois, and it was Mason's uh, children. <coughs> so they and the, and by the way, this uh, child was found dead, and it was pretty grievous at the time, and and uh, so that's why it got started. It was just a it's a program that we felt was really necessary, you know, for the for the country. And it's being done in 29 states now. It's not done in all 48, but it's done in 29. And, and we feel it's, if we can just save one person, one, one child, the whole program is worth it. Yeah, no question about it. Yeah. Uh, child, identifica child identification program, uh, make sure you get your child uh, taken care of and get all these things done in the case of a, a tragedy for your family. 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. coming up this Saturday at the Fleasbaugh Center at the YMCA West Camp south of the zoo. Thank you very much, Don. We'll take a break, and Lola will talk about Celebrate Healthy Family Kids Day, also going on at the same time, right after this. Okay, now let's see. Is that one better? <laughs> no, but I, I can sit right there. And <laughs> <laughs> no, go on, go on. I'm glad I you don't care which one you sit okay. at. Okay. Okay. Images on five jumbo screens, high speed video. <laughs> Jumping and around like a little duck around the chair. You need to call. <laughs> All right. It's a premier right. multifunction facility for your next business meeting. Call 436 6888 or visit us at www.daringciviccenter.com. Now you have to talk to Chris. Civic Center. This is how Oh, you want to talk to Chris as well afterwards? Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got to set up some PSAs for okay. our campaign. We can do that. <laughs> <laughs> Now that I'm here, I might as well, you know. All right, we are back on News Extra this morning. We're talking about Celebrate Healthy Family Kids Day. It's coming up at the Y, 9 to 2 p.m. out of Trails West YMCA camp. And uh, Lola, you've, you've been, uh, again, this is another program that's going on for <laughs> some time. 
You got more sponsors this year, more things to do. More things to do. One of the things about the Healthy Kids uh, Families Day, we actually have been doing this since 2001. Yeah, long time. Um, and with the CHIP program uh, seven years ago, uh, combining, partnershiping with them, it has been so positive. We've ran um, maybe two to three hundred children and families coming out. We usually have about close to 350 to 400 families out there at the camp that day. So how exciting. Yeah, it really is. And uh, uh, you've got a lot of sponsors and a lot of things going on. So let's kind of run through okay. what people get a chance to do because uh, all these sponsors have certain things they're kind of uh, uh, taken care of. Well, when we started, we only had about five sponsors, and now we're up to about 15 sponsors. How exciting. A lot of people want to help us out with this. We do have the McDonald's ice cream coupons. We have the Wendy's free Frosties. There will be snow cones out there. Ello is providing popcorn and water. And Arbor Health is coming out for the first time this year uh, and giving us some healthy fruit snacks. Well, that's good. Very exciting. That's a, just our snack that's part. Just, that's just the food <laughs> part. Okay, now let's talk about the activity part. There's a, a lot of activities. We'll have the giant planet uh, house provided by Ron, the Planet Bounce. Uh, we'll have archery. We'll have the miniature pony rides by Debbie and Lauren Thompson. They'll have two sets of pony rides. So, uh, the ponies, um, they'll have the single pony ride, and they'll have a buggy. But there's a stipulation between that. Um, we do have to have the child no more than 100 pounds to get on these pony ponies. Okay. So, yeah. Kids okay, are going to so be small. We just want kind of little kids. Little kids, please. Little kids, please. Little kids. All right. And then uh, Western Nebraska Community College is coming out. The basketball is going to be helping out with the chip program. Yep. And also maybe some fun tattoos. Looks like you got the volleyball team out there too, maybe? Uh, no, they're do in a tournament. They're no, in a I've tournament? Got okay. Go, 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 WNCC. All right. All right. Uh, we do have the big tower one, the 100 ladder, uh, Scottsdale Fire Department. They're bringing down Sparky the gong. So that's how exciting that is. Uh, the police car will be there with the bomb uh, robot for the kids to look at. Okay. And the troops, uh, Troopy Scott's Bluff, We'll have the seatbelt machine by the Nebraska State Patrol. All right, so Chuck Ellie will probably be there. Yes, he day. will. He will. All right. We have a couple more uh, entities here. We have uh, the Community Action Partnership of Western Nebraska. They're going to do the octopus uh, ring toss and covered tree health care of Nebraska. First time ever is going to bring uh, down a Wii Fit uh, and do BMIs for health education for our children and they got the doc bear there how many fun things but there is one big big deal that's going to be happening that's right all right the swim camp you got a chance to swim on saturday 11 a.m to 2 mm -hmm. the pool will be open yes that's cool parents need to be with children right no drop-ins guys yeah it's not if, a, it's not a babysitting thing right no it's a child family healthy day that's right family health day yes right? okay yes. so the parents are supposed to be there mm -hmm. looks like you're gonna have an outdoor climbing wall and an obstacle course too is that also part yes, of this uh, we have an obstacle course that's on the other side of the camp which will be provided so we will have that and also, I forgot, our rolling oldie car club, is, uh, they're going to have a little car out there with Tom McLean. He's going to be driving our children up and down the Riverside Park. All right. It's a 1928 Model A Roadster. It is. It so, is. So all of this, 9 to 2, including the chip identification program, 9 yes. to 2 out there at uh, the YMCA West Camp, just south of the zoo. Mm -hmm. Easy to find. Yes. And like you said, should be tons of fun. Oh, tons of fun and how important it is to have your child with this chip identification. Parents, take care of your children. That's why we're doing this. Bring them down. All right, very good. Well, thanks much, Lola, appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks for coming in.